I am an entrepreneur. I am an innovator. I am a Filipino first advocate. I'm Doi47 and I'm on top of my game. for guesting on our show. A wise woman knows that to be successful, she needs to build a firm foundation with the bricks thrown at her. Sabi nga nila, when life gives you lemons, make lemonade. And Doi is a living proof of this. Hi, Doi! Hello, Pia! Oh my gosh, it is such a pleasure and such an honor to meet you. Kasi ano and it's my yung... pleasure. It's my oh pleasure. my gosh, thanks for being here on our show. And uh, can you tell us a bit about how you started this business? Um, I started first Vita Plus 15 years ago uh, with a dream na sana lahat equal. You know, with that, uh, I was 32, I think, when I started the, the business. And syempre, talagang idealist. I, I hate it when I see people uh, begging in the streets. Sabi ko, ang Pinoy masipag. Uh, at syempre, lahat naman may pangarap. So, why yung opportunities hindi pantay-pantay? And so, I started with a business with one thing in mind that, you know, I'll offer a business that would not require anything from anyone except their dreams. I also would like to showcase the Filipino ingenuity. So, kasi noon, uso yung mga green tea, and uh, all the imported uh, herbs. Yes. And so I told myself, magaling naman yung mga herbs ng, ng Philippines, it's just that, hindi natin pa, or maybe hindi pa well um, accepted during that time, yung alternative uh, uh, lifestyle and medicine. And so, actually, it's, it's a drink. And then we started with one variant, that is Dalandan, sobrang Pinoy, and then with five power herbs na Filipino. So, we had malunggay, which is now very popular all over the world, hindi lang dito sa Pilipinas. And then we have uh, talbos ng kamote, dahon ng sile, uray, and saluyot. And so, what I did was, put it in a ready-to-drink, um, in a sachet, na powder, easy to drink, uh, good to taste, and there it is. Para every day, you get the... Yes. The vit super vitamins yes, and nutrients, nutrients of these five ingredients. Mm -hmm. no? Pero, Doi, very uh, gutsy rin yung move na ginawa mo. Kasi, you were in the shoe business. And then, what made you start something that was completely different? Yes, I started with the shoe business. Kasi yung family ko uh, was into uh, shoemaking. So, we had the business for 40 years. Just that, uh, you know, with the influx of the China-made shoes, so yung marikin na shoe industry I'm slowly sad, no? yes yes I know kasi yun yung talagang uh, lahat ng tao sa marikina almost all the people there pagkataal na taga marikina ka meaning pag taga doon ka marunong ka gumawa ng sapatos okay. so doy nag you encountered a lot of struggles and obstacles doon sa shoe making business and eventually you had to put yes. an end to it na rin yes kasi if you're going to close shop then do it now not tomorrow parang ganun so, I started with uh, another company, yung First Vita Plus. Ito naman, ano mga klaseng hurdles yung Ay, ma mga madami din. Sobra kasi, syempre, ayan na naman yung colonial mentality na Parang, ay, bakit ay, malunggay, oh. ba? Bakit uh, talbos ng kamote, saluyot, eh, eh, you know, parang yung mga lola pa namin ang, ang, ang kumakain yan. Lalo na ngayon yung mga bata ngayon, yung mga millennials, ayaw na ng, ng mga gulay. So that was really a big uh, struggle for me. Pa, paano mo yun in-overcome? Okay, so what I did was, ang mga anak ko kasi yung mga ano ko eh, yung uh, part sila ng product development yung, team. Oh, okay. okay. So tinanong ko yung mga anak ko, ano yung pinakamasarap na, na fruit? para sa inyo ng, ng Pinoy. So, sabi nila, dalangdan. So, yun, I put the five power herbs, I call them five power herbs, into dalangdan juice. And then, uh, it became a big hit, not only for us adults, but especially to the kids. Yeah. 
So they love. So you put it in something that they love. Yes. So para na hindi nila alam oh, na oh, kung makain. Oh, oh. You're <laughs> na actually. Na pala sila ng ng mga ng vegetables. Oh, oh. oh. So ganon yun ang naging ano ko uh, idea ko that about that. That was your strategy. Yes. How I'm wondering lang. You are so pleasant. You run a very successful business. What kind of a boss are you? Are you more of a oh my god? Para bang dabar cards, mabait ba? Yes. Dragon you know, lady. Ah, uh, both, both. <laughs> okay. They know. They know that. Yeah. Pagka trabaho, sobrang trabaho. Kasi perfectionist ako. Okay. Hindi para sa akin hindi pwede ang pwede na. Yes. So always a notch higher. Pero pag tapos sa trabaho, ay sobra. Sobrang kain, sobrang shopping, lahat sinasama ko ang staff ko. Out of town, out of the country para sa uh, R&R. Yun, for giving me talagang such a yung kasi hectic nga yung yung schedule namin lahat. Okay. And yet, you managed to stay Uh, looking so great and so young. Oh, thank you. You're all 47 years old. I'm 47. And I think that people should know that because you look beautiful. You look great. Thank you, thank you. Ano bang secret? Ano ba yung five power herbs bang secret? Diyan, iinom na rin ako niyan. That's one. <laughs> and then second, of course, yung lifestyle. Uh -huh. Kasi dati, uh, whenever I hear that, Uh, dapat healthy lifestyle. And hindi ko pa yon masyadong uh, parang uh, tinitake seriously. Kasi, okay. you know, when you're in your 30s... You don't care. Yeah, you yes. feel like you're gonna live forever. Yeah, exactly. But when I started, when, uh, kailan ba yun? On my 40s na. Yun na. Simula nang bumabagal ang metabolism. Okay. You so, actually felt it. Yes, okay. yes. And then, of course, you get tired easily. Mm -hmm. uh, sabi ko, It must be that hindi lang diet dapat. So kaya nga uh, I got a personal trainer. Yeah. Kasi nabasa ko that you know when you start aging, you have to do both mm -hmm. exercise and diet to have a healthy lifestyle. Syempre I love myself. So I take good care of myself. Syempre yung yung aking routine, yung exercise. Normally it runs in a circuit. So Uh, bale, five exercise siya in a circuit, and then you have to repeat it uh, uh, for four times, so four circuits. Siguro, it will give you around an hour to complete the whole uh, four cycles. Pero sabi nila, di ba, mind and body yan. So, you've taken care of the body part. Mm -hmm. How about the way you think Ay, of nako, Don't I'm... stress the small stuff yes, ba? Yes, um, don't, don't sweat the small stuff. Oh, oh. Parang ganun. Oh, oh. Na, you know, I do not lose sleep over something replaceable. Whereas before, baka Ay, sobrang freak out ka. Yes, kasi sobrang <laughs> OC ako. Okay. Sobrang perfectionist. But now, go yes. with the flow. Go. Okay, you just roll with the punches. Yes. Ika nga. Being a woman, syempre, shoes, bags. Well, I call it my reward for working hard. So hard. Um, at the end of the day, syempre, you want something that you really love as a reward for all the things that you've done. And those things, especially my family, make me happy. And running this successful business for 15 years... For 15 years. Uh, what do you think is the secret to it? Uh, number one uh, are the people. Sila yung what keeps me, what drives me every day and the purpose i know that the purpose i have in doing the business is greater than myself that i was able to make a huge difference in the lives of so many people who've lost hope already sila yung palaging reminder sa akin every day that i should get up get to work because merong pang isang buhay na nangangailangan ng tulong And the failures, Doi, how do you make the failures into your strengths? I never consider them failures mm -hmm. because I always consider them as opportunities to grow, to learn from. Because I'm not the kind of na always negative. Eh. I, or, I always make it a point to see the positive side of things. Mm -hmm. Na if there are challenges, I always ask, so what is this trying to teach me? 
what is God trying to teach me for giving me this uh, obstacle or this uh, struggle. So, palaging ganon yung mindset ko. I, palagi akong, okay, what's next? So, this is happening. So, we can't do anything about it anymore. So, what's next? We have to plan ahead. Galing, galing. So, you're the boss of your own company. You look beautiful. You, you look great. I wonder, Doi, um, if you're also the boss in the house. Kasi you have a husband. You have three kids. Yes. Um, na 22 years old. Yes. Uh, 20 years old and 5 years old. So, yung 5 years old, ang boss naming lahat. <laughs> oh, before I elaborate on yes. that, we're gonna take a short break and we'll be back with Doi with more. When I was in four, ma, 40 years old, sabi ng husband ko, we will be adopting. Okay, a kasi na-miss niya. Oo, oh, empty nest na talaga kami. I'm, I'm only 40, sabi ko, let's try and uh, consult our, uh, my ob guy ni. Sinek niya yung quality of my eggs. So sabi niya, pwede pa. What are you like at home? Ikaw din ba yung boss kapag nandun ka sa bahay? Well, si Gabby talaga yung boss. <laughs> yung five-year-old ko. Siya yung boss ng lahat. Uh, well, I have two uh, children, children na 22 and 19 going on 20. Grown up na yung dalawa. Yes. Adult na. <laughs> How did it happen na biglang... Oh, oh. Was this a planned pregnancy? Yung yes, five it was. Year it old was, it was. When I was in four, ma, 40 years old, sabi ng husband ko, we will be adopting. Okay. Baby, kasi na-miss niya. Oo, oh, empty nest na talaga kami. Wala nang maingay, wala nang makulit. So, siguro na-miss niya talaga yon. So, sabi ko, uh, why not? I'm I'm only 40. Sabi ko, let's try and uh, consult our uh, my ob guy ni. And then, yon when I had my test, ultrasound and everything, chinek niya yung quality of my eggs. So, sabi niya, pwede pa. So, at 41, I got pregnant and gave birth to Gabby. Wow. Mm -hmm. And healthy, strong ah, yes. baby. Yes. Very healthy. Nako, very smart. Mm -hmm. And iba, ibang, ibang baby. Happy baby. Pero grabe talaga yung drive ninyo, no, Doi? Parang ikaw, when you put your mind to it, hindi ka talaga tumitigil. Oh, yes. Nothing keeps you from doing it. When I put my heart and mind into something, diba? talaga, go, go, go. Some women would be discouraged by the fact na, naku, 40 years old na ako, hindi na ako pwede magkaanak. Pero ikaw, you actually uh, pursued yes. the possibility. Siguro I'm a risk taker, for one. And then I do not wallow on the what if or uh, baka ganito. No, I just go for it. If I believe in something, then I go for it. And it turned out to be the best pregnancy of the yes. three. Yes. Diba? Very, very easy. And you know, up to the last day na mga nganda ko kung nyari tomorrow, today I'm still working. Talagang ganon yung energy ko, ganon yung stamina. Okay. What, what are you like as a mom? I bet you were different nung ba mas bata ka no. as you are now. No, I'm I'm not a spoiler. Mm, never been. But okay. I've never been. Uh, very strict ako. Between juggling your duties as a mom to three and running your very big company of how many dealers? Uh, to date, we are 2.5 million dealers worldwide. 2.5 million dealers. Meron pa ba bang panahon para kay Miss Ter? Ay, syempre. Yung pagmamanage ng time, you only have 24 hours. That's it. Parang kulang sa'yo. 24 hours. <laughs> kulang eh. na kulang. Pero yung priority. So you have to prioritize. Uh, Siyempre, hindi equal yung time with each and every child and, and kay, kay Sok, my husband. Yeah. But, pagka sila na, yung pagka it's their turn na kasama ko sila, sila lang dapat yung 100%, 100% oo, na attention ko How sa kanila lang. How do you keep your uh, love life? Exciting Hi. and spicy. You've been married how many For years? For 23 years. Oh, 23 years. Yes. How do you keep it 
Well, uh, like next week, uh, ang gift ko sa kanya nung Valentine's Day is a trip to uh, Amanpuri in Phuket. Kasi Aman Junkie kami. Oh. So, yon Yung mga ganon, yung mga uh, spur of the moment. Pero plan ko yon para sa akin. Sa kanya, spur of the moment. Pero sa akin, <laughs> plan na yon So, I uh, asked for uh, like a 45-day uh, schedule for, from my, yun nga, from my hectic uh, schedule just to be with him. Your plate is full, mm -hmm. ika nga, no, Doyi. But I wonder kung at 47, what you consider your best achievement ever. And we're going to find out what Doi has to say about that after this. We'll be right back. How do you keep the sex life still exciting at this stage? Oh, may ganun rin yung question. <laughs> <laughs> okay na. Sok naman is submissive. <laughs> At 47, uh, the greatest thing that I've learned about life is to always give your best. 100 over zero. Siguro my greatest fulfillment in life is that I'm able to share the many blessings that I'm given by also helping other people uh, fulfill their dreams. Yung business ng First Fight of Us. Yun yung uh, advocacy namin. To help the least, the last, and the lost. So, uh, that's really one thing that I'm so proud of in this lifetime. That I was able to make a huge difference in the lives of so many people. Dapat, hindi tayo sumitigil na maging pangarap lang. Dapat gawin natin na maging plano, maging goal. Okay? Iba sabi nila, paano ka makakashoot sa basketball kung walang goal? So, ganun din sa buhay. Paano ka makakashoot? makakakuha ng mga inaasam natin na pangarap kung hindi mo siya gagawin na doon. Ngayong 47 years old ka na, if you had a chance to talk to your 30-year-old self, ano yung sasabihin mo sa kanya? Ah, uh, that it's never too early to give your very best. Uh, that I know tomorrow will present many possibilities. But today is a treasure that you should not take for granted. Mm -hmm. At this point, uh, after achieving all this, meron ka pa bang gustong magawa? Meron ka pa bang gustong achieve? I mean, at my age, I really want to learn how to sing. Kasi ako, whenever I do something, ayoko ng uh, mediocre. Gusto ko grand and big and to the full. I would like to sing. <laughs> to learn how to sing. But not only sing. Do a concert, live concert at the Araneta Coliseum with 10,000 people watching me. And with your drive, hindi malabong mangyari. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> Para baka next year, mabalitaan na lang namin. Meron na akong uh, record. I mean, I'm CD. Hindi na pala record. Joy live at the Araneta. <laughs> On top of all that, you've managed to make a marriage for 23 years. In this day and age where people just separate all the time, paano mo yung nagawa? Maswerte lang kami because we're in the same business. Okay. Uh, Sok is the chairman of the company and I'm the president and CEO. So, we are basically together in the company. Yung, yung 23 years married ba, does it still feel like uh, five being five years married. Ganun din, ganun pa rin especially, especially with Gabby. Okay. Na nan kasi parang we had to start all over again, start from scratch. We would bring Gabby to the play area, uh, go shopping with Gabby sa sa baby uh, section, you know, and uh, uh, play with her. So parang we're we're just newly wed. Kasi nga because of Gabby. Yung pala ang isang secret yes. to the success of our marriage. Have another kid. Yes. Late in your, <laughs> ano, in your marriage, yes. di ba? How do you keep the 
sex life still exciting at this stage? Oh, may g- ganun talaga yung question. <laughs> <laughs> okay na. Ano naman tayo? Prime time um, na tayo. We can talk about this. That's one thing na dapat hindi ma... Ma- mawala. mawala sa equation yes diba? oh of course that's part of the physiological uh, need uh-huh. of every human being especially of a married couple so uh, playful well, pa rin kayo with each other yes oh and then yung uh, uh kasi ano ko eh touchy ako eh uh-huh. oh, and uh, sweet ako eh naturally so yun siguro and then Sok naman is submissive. <laughs> <laughs> Ikaw pala yung boss sa ano, a bedroom ha. <laughs> so, yun, uh, it still is uh, exciting. Dory, it was so inspiring to hear your stories about life and about your business. And napakaganda nung ginagawa mo. You're giving everybody a chance to make their lives better through your business. It's such a pleasure to meet you. Thank you so much. Thank you Tia. so much for Thank being you. I enjoyed here. It. Thank you so much. And thank you for coming to our show, Doi. I'm sure that a lot of people will be inspired by your stories uh, of your remarkable success. Thank you for being an inspiration not only to 40-something women, but to everyone, women of all ages. I've learned a lot from you today, certainly. Pero I am still curious about a few more things. So, meron po tayong game. For this one, all you need to do is flash the right card that will signify at what age you did what. Are you going to do this? I think. Yes. <laughs> I don't okay. think. Sorry, we'll have choice. Oh, no. <laughs> First time you ever had to fire someone. Nako, 20s. Kaya lang sleep naman na ka mag-fire. Ah, sleep naman. Okay. Paano yan? Paano yan? Uh, hindi ka na mag-report bukas po. So, <laughs> <laughs> may respeto pa rin. Oh. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, first house. 30s. The last time you had a crazy adventure? 40s. 40s. Yeah. The first time you learned to cook? Uh, baka younger. First time to experience heartbreak? Never. Never? Uh-oh. First wife in movies? Never, so? yes. A first? Oh my gosh. And last? So, never. Never. Galing! <laughs> never been hurt. <laughs> One of the perks of being in your 40s is that you are already in control. Wala na insecurities, you already gain respect, and that you are confident. One of the pains of being in your 40s is that palagi ka na kinukuhang ni nang sa kasal. Dati kasi sa binyag lang, ngayon pati na rin sa kasal. 